Watch this NVIDIA demo and imagine actually speaking to AI game characters. At Computex 2023 in Taipei, NVIDIA CEO Jensen Huang just gave the world a glimpse of what it might be like when gaming and AI collide with a graphically breathtaking rendering of a cyberpunk ramen shop where you can actually talk to the proprietor. Seriously, instead of clicking on dialogue options, it imagines you could hold down a button, just say something with your own voice, and get an answer from a video game character. NVIDIA is calling it a peek at the future of games. Unfortunately, the actual dialogue leaves a lot to be desired, maybe try GPT-4 or Sudorite next time, NVIDIA? Watching a single video of a single conversation, it's hard to see how this is any better than picking from an NPC dialogue tree, but the impressive part is that the generative AI is reacting to natural speech. Hopefully NVIDIA will release the demo so we can try it ourselves and get some radically different outcomes. The demo was built by NVIDIA and partner Convi to help promote the tools that were used to create it, specifically a suite of middleware called NVIDIA AC, Avatar Cloud Engine, for games that can run both locally and in the cloud. The entire ACE suite includes the company's Nemo tools for deploying large language models, LLMs, Reva speech-to-text and text-to-speech, among other bits. The demo uses more than just those, of course, it's built in Unreal Engine 5 with loads of ray tracing and it's visually stunning to the point that the chatbot part feels lackluster to me by comparison. At this point, we've simply seen much more compelling dialogue from chatbots, even as trite and derivative as they can sometimes be. In a Computex pre-briefing, NVIDIA VP of GeForce platform Jason Paul told me that yes, the tech can scale to more than one character at a time and could theoretically even let NPCs talk to each other, but admitted that he hadn't actually seen that tested. It's not clear if any developer will embrace the entire AC toolkit the way the demo attempts, but SALKR2 Heart of Chernobyl and Fort Solis will use the part NVIDIA calls Omniverse Audio 2 Face, which tries to match facial animation of a 3D character to their voice actor's We're speech. We are thrilled to showcase 